What's up guys, it's the Kiwi Dragon here and I'm back again with a brand new video with CTR Nitro Fueled Online Lobby Bingo. Now this was a concept that I sort of adapted from the YouTuber Creepy Produce. Uh, if you'd like to go and check his channel out, he does this sort of thing for uh, Mario Kart Wii and for Super Mario Maker. Uh, but basically I've got a bingo board here with 25 slots and the object of this video is to get bingo and when I get bingo the video shall end. Uh, you can see all the categories on the board here, so really it's just a case of trying to get bingo without making this video incredibly long. So um, let's get it over and done with then, shall we? Okay, so let's see who we've got in the lobby here, see if we can clear a couple of these slots already. Ah, we got a Megumi! There we go, so we've seen one of the Nitro Squad, that is all good, that is perfect. So we can tick that off the list, so we're already off to a flying start, that's fantastic. Just waiting to see now if we can tick anything else off. Got a couple more guys coming in. We got a baby crash. Oh, we got a Yaya. It's perfect. We have got a Yaya. Which means we can now tick off the same character as well. That is awesome. Okay, so here we are at Ruse Tubes. Hopefully we can get maybe a couple of these items ticked off. It'd be nice to have maybe a few of them just rid off the board. Not sure what we can really expect to see here. Around the first bend. Oh, we got a golden crate. We can see if we can get this golden wumper off the list. Come on, come to me, come to me. Yes! All right, we've got a golden wumper off the board. That is perfect. Go away. Leave me alone. Lasad Kazoo will not leave me alone. Actually, this might be perfect. If someone else can pass me, maybe I can clinch third. I mean, I'd like to win, obviously, but I'd prefer to maybe clinch third, because third is on the board here, getting third place. So it'd be nice to get that rid off the board nice and early. Then I don't have to worry about it later on. Yeah, I'm not sure I'm going to catch Lissad Kazoo. Oh! I was not paying attention that good on me. I'm too busy talking that I'm not paying attention. <sighs> yeah, I don't I don't think thirst is gonna be possible. Oh, hang on, we got Chick right behind us, so if Chick passes us, we could just clinch third. I could just pull over and just let him pass, but let's see if he'll fight me for it. Come on, Chick, put up a fight. Fight me, come on. Oh great, I hit my own green. Was that my green? I'm pretty sure it was my green. And I failed to snipe the chick, so that's not good. It's alright, we've got third, so if I can hold on to third, the next closest is the Nash, and he is ages away, so... No! Safe to say that we have clinched third, so we can knock that one off the list as well. So we've got the gold one, but and we got the uh, third place. So that's a pretty good start, I'm pretty sure uh, you'll agree on that one, so I'm pretty happy with that. Now, I don't know about you guys, but I really, really love Nina's Nightmare. It's probably my favorite, or one of my favorite tracks that they added in the uh, Grand Prix, uh, alongside Mega Mix Mania, but I really love the track. I really love the design aesthetic, the whole spooky kind of thing. Uh, but it's also a nice layout as well. It's um, pretty basic for a USF track, but I quite like it. Anyway, this chick will not get out of my way. Go away. Leave me alone. Get out of the way. Ah, great, I hit clip the wall. <sighs> this is not going well. It's all right, hopefully he'll be squished by the pumpkin spider legs. Nope, no, he won't. That's, that's a great start. Jump over the fence. Come here, chick. See if we can snipe him with the shield. Yes, we can, and we ruin his USF. Although I didn't really think I got a good USF of myself, so probably not gonna hold it that long, and we didn't. So that's a bit shit, but that's okay. Hopefully we can hold on to this lead. Put a green there. Try and get a bit more boost up. Come on. See if we can build our reserves up a bit more. That chick is gaining. I don't know if it's just... I don't know, maybe did he get... No, he couldn't have got the blue fire. No, so he'll be going about the same speed as me. That's okay. I thought he was gaining. I was like, no way you've got blue fire. And he's gone around the same side as me, so he won't be doing the uh, double cross catch-up. Get the blue. Come on, give me some. No, nope. totally missed the one, but great. 
Got a ghost though at least. I don't even know, what is the point of catching ghosts in this track anymore? I mean, I remember when the Grand Prix were on, it used to be the whole thing of catching ghosts. Oh, we got a shortcut. Uh, I didn't really fail that one. I saw oh, clock! We've got a trophy clock! There we go, that is one we can check off the list at least. Uh, I won't check off the shortcut because I didn't really fail it. I still drove over it, but it wouldn't exactly be a fail. And we got a warp orb! We got a warp orb! I've just noticed my mini map. We got a warp orb. And we have got a shield. Alright, let's keep it. Keep it tight. There we go. Warp orb dodge with the shield. Thank you very much. And this race is going to be ours in the bag. But yeah, I don't understand the whole point of catching the ghosts. I mean, do they add to the reserves or are they just a fun thing for you to collect now on the track? That's what I was trying to say earlier on before I got cut off about the shortcut. Um, if you guys actually know what, what the deal is with the ghosts now, if they're just a little fun collectible, just let me know in the comments below, just because I keep meaning to look it up, but I keep forgetting. So, if you guys know and just want to let me uh, know what the uh, go is with that one, I'd really sincerely appreciate that. Nice, healthy lead on that chick, so I'm pretty happy with that. We've got a couple more ticked off the list, so we've got the uh, trophy clock and we've got the warple. We got both in the same race. That is surprising. I was not really expecting to see that so quickly. So unfortunately the last lobby died, so now I'm having to go back into a new lobby. And we've got a couple of the guys that were there, I think. I think... No? I, I remember Ray Meldrum was in the last one at least. <sighs> I'll have to see if anybody else pops up. Hopefully we can get a couple more... Uh, crosses on the board. I'd really like to get some more. Come on. Why is nobody using a classic cart or a cove cruiser? Oh, we got two more. Come on, who are you? Show me, show me, show me, show me, show me. Yes, we got a pair of classic carts and they're both Cocos. You've got Alice Coco and Re is that retro? No, that's just normal Coco, but that's still cool. We've got a pair of Cocos. Okay, so for this race, I'm hoping to see if we can blitz past everyone and get the no damage because I think Koala Kong is one of my strongest tracks. Uh, Koala Kong. Koala Carnival. What am I on about? Koala Carnival is one of my strongest tracks. Um, no, I, I'm definitely sure that I can blitz ahead of these guys provided we haven't got any really good players in here. Uh, and see if we can just take first place and see if we can make it through with that damage. Uh, if not, we can overlap somebody and they can damage. Oh, great. I just clicked them all. I am really good today. I am half asleep, apparently. Doesn't matter. We're still in the lead. Why are you going to fire a missile at me when I'm just going over that ramp? What is the point? Oh, hello. Maybe you got triple missile. That's not good. Um, shit, 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 shit. Uh, go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. <laughs> Go away! I don't want to have to bomb back at you because I'll probably fail! Go back! Oh no, it's fine. The ramp saved me. We're good. We are so good right now. And we are blitzing ahead. Look at that, Geary! We are blitzing ahead of these guys. So that is perfect. Now if I just keep the momentum going, we can maybe get through this whole track without damage. I mean, aside from that clip at the uh, beginning where I hit the wall, uh, yeah, I mean, that was damaging to my ego. But nonetheless, we haven't actually received any actual, like, weapon damage, so hopefully we can keep that up. I mean, otherwise it's going to be really annoying if I make it through and someone, I don't know, maybe leaves a potion or leaves a TNT or a nitro or something, but so far nobody has left anything on the ground, which is cool. I am happy. We have got clean roads for us to drive through, so it's going good. I don't think I'm going to catch and overlap these guys, so I think that's going to be a negatory good buddy on that one, but we can still make it across the line, hopefully without damage. Oh, there's a couple of... Yeah, as I said, TNT and a red potion there. But swiftly going past those, and across the line! So we can officially tick off the no damage uh, section of the board, which I am pretty happy with. As I said, that was one that if I had really good players to go up against, I thought I was going to be screwed. But no, we're good, so we can take that one off the board. Okay, so we are off to Coco Park, which admittedly is like one of my least favorite tracks in CTR. 
I don't know, it's just kind of a bit basic and I'm just not really a fan of it. I like the USF tracks a bit more than the, uh, you know, the non-Blue Fire tracks. Oh, we got a fail to start game! That is perfect! And on a track that I don't really like all that much, but... Yeah, fail to start game is fail to start game, so we can officially tick that one off the board. Oh yeah, we got drive through danger. Come on, come on, drive through danger, drive through danger. Come on, come on. I need to check this one off the board. Come on, don't go for clockwork. Come on, drive through, drive through. Oh, you son of a! All right, hopefully this track is one that we can tick off a. Couple more slots on the board. Again, I'm not really a huge fan of this. Oh, we got a golden wumper again. Come on, give me that golden. For God's sake, seventh from first. Like, wow. What did I do to deserve that? Anyway, so we get back up to third now, and I think I lost that golden wumper. Oh no, I can hear it. There it is. Come on, come to me, come to me, come to me. You little bastard! You swept to the side! It's alright, we'll get this one. Come on, give me this one. No, I'm going to have to take the shortcut. I have to abandon it. I'll come back to you later. <sighs> come on, come on, come on. going to get past first place. Got USF. Come on! This baby Coco must have USF as well. Probably, I don't know. And I just lost. Oh! Did someone just rage quit? We got a rage quitter! Rage quit! Yes, sir, we have a rage quit, so we can add that one to the board. Thank you very much. That is awesome. Let's see if we can get this golden one, but come here. I want your sweet nectar. Thank you. And I did not do the jump properly on that, so we're going to lose. Yeah, we're going to lose fire instantly. Well done. I clipped that wall, but I still kept fire. That's that's interesting. Sometimes that happens. You clip a wall, and sometimes you manage to keep the fire. I, I, I don't know. This game is broken sometimes. I love it. It's a love-hate relationship, though. You, you've got to admit, if you're, if you're a fan of CTR Nitrofield, there's days where you love it, and then there's days where you literally just want to take the disc out and just burn it in your fireplace. It's just, it's, it's a love-hate relationship. But anyway, I don't think we're going to get first. I think this baby Coco has well and truly beaten us to it, which is fine. I spent a lot more time trying to go after the golden wumper. Oh, look, it's the retro Coco that quit. Hello, goodbye. Now, can I hold the USF? Come on, USF, round the corner. Nice, 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 nice. But yeah, now we've got the uh, rage quit off the board, so that is cool by me. So, that was what I wasn't expecting to see. I mean, I wasn't expecting to see the uh, lobby die either, so that's actually pretty helpful. So, they're on the same side of the board, I think, even. Hang on, let me have a look. Yeah, they're all on the same side of the board, so I only need to get hit off the track and see a friend online. But we're making nice progress, so hopefully we can get there. <sighs> so, once again, the lobby has died, and again, that's... That's another reason that I have a love-hate relationship with CTR is that the servers are a bit meh and people just drop off like mayflies, so... <sighs> but either way, I still love the game, I just... There, there are some elements that I dislike. Maybe I'll make a video about it in the future or about what they can fix in a, in a future installment of CTR, but anyway. Oh, we got Frosty! Frosty has arrived! Thank you, buddy! Uh, Frosty is a good friend of mine. He is part of my uh, crew that I race with, uh, New Zealand-based crew. Uh, his name is Tyler, so he is a friend of mine. So we can officially check off the see a friend online on the board, and hopefully we can go to Mega Mix because I haven't done Mega Mix today, and I really don't want to do Koala Carnival for God's sake. We've already been there today, guys. I don't even have go to the same track twice on the board. I maybe need to do that for a future installment because. Sometimes you guys are way too repetitive on your track choices. Now, as far as I'm aware, getting hit off Koala Kong... It, uh, Koala Kong. I've said that twice in this video. Getting hit off the track in Koala Carnival is practically 
I, I don't want to say impossible, but I feel like it is. I mean, I, you can go out of bounds for sure, but I don't think there's a way to get hit off. And we've already made it into a clusterfuck. So that's a great start. And I'm straight down to four. <sighs> this is not how I wanted this race to begin, guys. That's, that's... For the love of God, why would you put a potion there? I... People. Just, no. It's okay, we're in fifth, we can climb back up, it's fine. What is this guy doing? He's like hopping along. He's not even drifting, he's just bouncing like a, he's on a pogo stick or something. It's fine, we can climb back up, come on. Pass some of these guys in the midfield and let's get to the top. Oh, yeah, no, I don't know if we can. I'm just looking at the mini-map right now and I can see that Pasadena has floored it. Hopefully we can catch up. I mean, she seems to have hit the Zem, so... Zem, Zam, whichever one that is. I get confused, the names. I know that if, if you ask me to tell the difference between the two, I probably could, but I just, I, it's the names that get me screwed up. Oh, we got a triple! Let's see if we can get this guy. We've got two. Come on, come on, hold still. Where did that missile go? Wait, did that just tag back onto me? Oh, no, 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 no. Go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. Thank you. Was that my own missile tagging back onto me? I think it honestly was. That is... Another reason that CTR is a bit broken is the, the missile tracking. Like, I seem to recall. Don't get me wrong. Like, was it back in the old days in the original CTR? Oh, hang on. Hang on. We're gonna triple. One. I'm gonna feel like such a dick if I do this. Cause this would be the that's the fourth missile I fired at this guy. I feel like such a dick. But it's on the board and I have to do it. I am so sorry, Clan Fortescue. I am so sorry. I must seem like a massive arsehole for doing that, but it is on the board and I've got it ticked off. I am so sorry. If you ever see this video, I really apologize. Um what was I talking about before? Oh, missiles! I swear the missiles back in the day, didn't they used to go around corners, or am I just imagining things on the original CTR? Okay, so we're here at Megamix at last, despite the fact that last round everybody wanted to go to Koala Carnival! I said it right this time! Third time lucky! Anyway, there's plenty of spots here where I'm sure I could be hit off the track, but hopefully someone can, I don't know, maybe missile me off the track, or bomb me off the track, or something. I don't care which one, just... If I can get hit off the track, then that'll be bingo, and I'd really appreciate that. Frosty, get out of my way, dude. Let me pass. Come on. Get out of my way. Get out of my way. Get out of my way. Did you just try bomb me, you sly bitch? Ha! There we go. Frosty! Seriously, dude. Pull over. Let me pass. Uh, no, no, no. You go ahead. It's fine. I've totally not run out of reserves. It is fine. <sighs> I got so focused on trying to pass Frosty that I ended up losing the reserves. It's fine. I won't worry about it. Alright. Those guys are so far behind. I don't know if even this is going to be the perfect track to get me hit off. Anyway. Leave a green there. Got the fan blades. Come on. Wait, wait, wait. I got an idea. TNT! TNT! Yes! Off the track! And that is BINGO! Oh! 